every errand form and his chance of retiring you see, from life. You know, one of the best the ways to see time. how a guy's mind works to really see. No, I wasn't thinking it, but when you said it now, I had to take it. See what it type of person you're dealing with. Ask one question. What's the biggest animal you can beat in the fight? You ask that and you'll learn a whole lot in a short time. And in 2021, British firm YouGov did a survey. There's a lot to unpack here, but mostly the 6% of Americans that think they could handle a grizzly without getting their existence nope. abolished. Not taking that chance. Two, what's the biggest animal? What's the biggest animal y'all think y'all taking? A two I think year old Aaron girl. said, oh yeah, he did, yeah, yeah. Two-year-old what? Gorilla. Gorilla. Two-year-old gorilla is what he said. About I, you? I'm not going to try and get into conflict in any way, shape, or form. What's the biggest animal, Scott? I don't even... A rat? A, a dog? What? I got probably a koala, probably. I don't fucking know. A koala? Okay, 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 okay. okay. That'd be a massacre. They don't need to fight back. There we go. There we go. And oh. that's how long it would take. Theirs oh. are inevitable enough to be one of the few that was quick. I have a one-shot rule against. As in, if they're coming at me full force and I have one shot in the chamber, I'm using it to self-medicate my exit off the mortal coil. I might not survive a hippo attack, but I'm for sure not surviving my reaction to one. I'll same day shit myself to the mortal hey. coil before I let a chimp handle me, and I'll self-subtract oh, look, it's a mic video. Quickness right. before a bear makes me part yeah. of its business. Bears are the- Also, I just got a question for the white people, you know? um. Why do y'all be petting bears? Y'all be giving bears bread and shit. They be trying to be friendly, bro. Bro, and I be looking, I be like, bro, these things will kill you. Yeah, they trying to be friendly, bro. They, bro, bears are terrifying. Yeah. I seen one lady, one lady lets one live on her porch. Oh, no. She tweaking. Yeah. She tweaking. Like, she literally she lets it live on her porch, and it attacks other bears that comes to that porch. Just for that bear to be like one day, yeah, uh, uh, I, I'm uh, gonna this is my port. Yeah, yeah, it's my port. The most <laughs> sexually inconsiderate creatures in nature. Hey, yo! Basically, a giant unhinged dog with every possible attribute. Can I pet that dog? No. Nature dropped an apex all-terrain CrossFit predator that can out How the fuck? And just let the what? rest of the population deal with it. But what's the most dangerous bear actually? Well, today we're gonna be polar talking bear, about every breed of yeah, bear. Yeah, I thought it was polar. Of putting you on a shirt. Each bear will get a Merc rating. Merc standing for might eviscerate, ravage, or just cancel you. Yep. Yeah, that's. Uh, I know. I think it will be number. I think number one's polar bear. But I know the sloth bear is up there because sloth bear. Yeah, they look like they won't. I think like they look like, like they an wanna, actual sloth or no, it's a no, bear. Sloth it's, bear. Just, oh. it's, just, it's like it, they don't look like they do it. Yeah, but, but they they'll do attack. It. Oh, if okay. I remember correctly, but that's the only two I know. And I think if it's black, get back. If it's brown, get down. But if it's yeah. white. Yeah, they they said yeah yeah something if, like if that. If it's white, you just say good night. You just yeah, fucking die night, for real. De definitely the K word that was supposed to be there. And as always, each rating will be in my very biased opinion. But yeah, call me Joe Rogan or Grinder Gladiator. Either way, we are going <laughs> Why down. Why you walking the bear like that, twin? Starting with the sun bear, named after the thing he spent way too long looking at. Those eyes stared at the void, and the void blinked first. And yes, they're built like they barely oh, qualify. That's to be the ones here. that walk. Looks like a bear with yeah, crippling social yeah. anxiety that got told to act natural. Or a dude in, in a costume. Yeah, in a controversy that shit is in terrifying. China. The controversy was nobody believed that, that wasn't yeah. a man in costume. To be fair, they're <laughs> easily the least coated Ursus out there. They're the smallest in the world at no heavier than a buck forty. And be honest, how long would it take for you to guess that foot was a attached to a grizzly's cousin. Those bare uh. feet help them climb trees, and some bears are the most tree-climby of them all. But how dangerous is this identity crisis? That sounds well, crazy. Shy, reclusive, and mostly eat fruits and plants. It's a long ass tongue, bro. I wouldn't say it in it's a freaky it, way. It, it felt freaky. It felt freaky. No, it didn't know what. It felt and y'all only saying that because it's me. No, we saying it because it felt freaky. Now I'm saying you sound aggressive because you a bear. What? what okay. No, I don't even sound right. aggressive. You sound, right shut now. up. It's, they're Not also trigger happy, nearly blind, and just, they shut up and stay in tigers. Sun bears are known to attack people when caught off guard, and their poor eyesight means they can easily get jump scared by humans. They also have mm. one of the strongest bite forces relative to body size of any oh. bear, but probably only because they use teeth to rip through oh. tree bark. There was even one oh. case where a sun bear tiger showdown ended up with both of them becoming past tense, so what could they do to a human? Well, from 2000 to 2010, there were 33 sun bear attacks on humans, with the most common injuries being facial. But all the attacks were oh. accidental encounters where the sun bears would probably argue self-defense. And to my knowledge, there are no recorded cases 
cases of a sun bear killing a person. So, okay. with no body count and being the smallest, but also being neurotic enough to be a threat, I'll creepy. give the sun bear yeah. a merc rating of five. Next, you have the Andean, also known as the Spectacle Bear. What the hell is that? Reasons. On paper, he's never the biggest of land predator never in that it. part of South America. Why only technically, because only 5% of four. That's what. You'd be like, there's bears in South America? You'd be like, yeah, it is that. I ain't never heard of this. Bro, day this is some crazy DLC. <laughs> <laughs> when did this load in? This is a crazy Price DLC. Diet is meat. Like the sun bear, they're only really a jihad to fruits and plants. Also like the sun bear, the walking spectacle is very tree climbing. They'll even build their version of a tree house to sleep in. To be fair, you don't really have a choice when your hall monitor's a jaguar. But don't think Buddy's sweet because he got glasses. They've been known to take out llamas, cows, oh. and even tapers twice their size. But how dangerous are they to the people? Well, in 2004, oh an God. Indian bear escaped Never from a more. Berlin Zoo and made a beeline for the children's area. What followed was one of the most gruesome displays ever caught on camera. Oh! Viewer discretion is advised. What? Apparently, the spectacled bear only has one human body on his record. And technically, oh, it was okay. a hunter who shot the bear out of a tree only for the bear to land on him. I'm sorry, Damn. but if you what? physics that, that hard, you deserve to so get packed up. Sorry. That is so the sorry. The sorriest hunter in the world. Ah, How you God. hunt the bear? And let it land Yo, on you. Yogi. <laughs> what are you doing? Hey, why that bear getting close? <laughs> what are you doing, Dragon Pup? What up? And yes, Paddington was indeed a spectacle. Spectacles are also the closest living relative of, yeah. Oh, okay. The short-faced bear. Oh, the duality. But considering the only casualty was more to slapstick than a homicidal bear, yeah. I give the spectacled beast a merc rating of two. And okay, now we're at yeah. the panda portion, which might confuse some since One. there's a genuine corner of the internet that'll tell you that pandas aren't actually bears. They'll sooner believe China has an obese biracial gerbil waddling around. <laughs> to be fair, being a bear but identifying as a bamboo processing plant is a questionable life choice. But one, bamboo is so protein packed that Ursus Oreo actually ends up getting just as much as wolves and feral cats. And two, binging bamboo all day means pandas actually have one of the strongest bite yeah, forces of any they land. Got to. Wild That's pandas hard. usually avoid people, and there's currently no record of a plus size ice. Are they they're dressed as they're pandas. pandas to release the panda into the in wild. Front a, in front of a jaguar. I think the jaguar is fake. Oh, okay. He got Shadow bleed. cotton ball killing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The pandas will 100% lash out if they think you deserve it. Those Often days with life altering vicious. consequences. Ooh. Nobody demonstrated Ooh. panda potential Ooh. more than straight at the Beijing Zoo, a young panda named Gugu. In 2006, a drunk dude climbed into the enclosure to give Gugu oh, a hug, and Gugu gave him an attitude adjustment with his teeth. After several minutes of biting each other, yes, Drunky bit the bear. They were eventually oh, separated with a fire hose. In 2007, a teenager tried was to giving him a hug. chunks ripped out of his legs to the point ah! where bones were showing. Ah! And in 2009, a father climbed over a barrier ah! to retrieve a toy his son dropped. His reward was his leg caught ah! in Gugu's vice grip jaws that keepers literally Jeez. had to pry open. I really think if Panas didn't wear the makeup, y'all would not be Trying them like this. Not at all. No, part about getting mauled by something so goofy is it probably takes a long time for bystanders to realize you're in trouble. They're the epitome of I'm not a killer, but don't push me. And for that, they get yeah. a merc rating of four. Cause really, if you get flatlined by a pair, that's it. You probably deserved it. Now we got the black bear, aka the fight back part of the rhyme, which is kind of yeah. true. Black bears are more likely to run away than run a fade. And after seeing them climb boy, trees, thank I you. I would have. Boy, I seen that clip before. I would have shit. <laughs> I'm chilling up. I would have. <laughs> Bro, you just sitting there scrolling TikTok, Instagram, and a bear? Duty. Look at his face. Look at his face. Probably a jump. Yeah. No. Bears are more likely to run away. He didn't know what to do. He said, please, please. He <laughs> wanted to throw the pillow. He said, please. <laughs> and after seeing them climb trees, thank the natural order yeah. for that. Oh. Although they probably only learned that from dealing with yeah. another. Yep. Bear that was terrifying too. Black bears are bear bear generalists. Man. They're smart enough and adaptable enough to live almost anywhere in America. Also, they're not always black, but that's besides the point. Moonlighting uh, as a giant raccoon means they run into people more than the average bear, and if you look at the numbers, they might not be as harmless as the nursery rhyme suggests. Since yeah. 1784, there have been 66 times where a black bear and a human resulted in one less human. That's Even really not that more, much, bro. There's just under 12 black yeah, bear conflicts no. a year. 52% are typically defensive, 33% were food motivated, and 15% were predatory. That okay. number's interesting, because that's actually higher than what you would see in brown bears. Folks now believe there's a slow, but very real rise in predatory male black bears murking people. In fact, the first ever fatal black bear attack in California just happened last month. Male blacks, but black That's bears it? that is, they have a wider range, which means a desperate down bad <laughs> male, male is more likely to try his luck on a hiker. The last stat I have is 88% of black bear assisted census subtractions were predatory, and 92% of those predatory pastimes 
were done by males. But when I say slow rise, we are still talking about one person getting clapped a year. Also, apparently none of those casualties carried pepper spray. So if you do that, hike in groups and put food and garbage away, you probably Bro, won't get how do you look at that and be like, I want to get closer. I want to get... No, just bro. At, just look at the skin color. Yeah. White people. You right. It's, it's white people shit. They walk like they a small ass nigga. I will. They, you, you know how muscle niggas walk like I will mess you up. That's how they ate. <laughs> I'm nigga. going to kill you in front of your family, oi. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. <laughs> By Smokey. In fact, a majority of Black Bear encounters end like a Mormon liaison where neither Ooh. side gets touched. So, they're flight over fight and statistically harmless. But they live yo, in close yo, proximity walk. with yeah, people facts. and are technically more likely to see U.S. free pizza than Grizzlies. So I'll give them a 6.5. Six, six <laughs> final answer. Not unlike their Asian cousins, and disclaimer, what? we're getting no. into the legitimately Whoa. dangerous Whoa. territory. Whoa. The Asiatic black bear, also Asiatic. called the blue bear, is the first honest threat to human way of life. Uh -oh. They're way more on sight than American black bears, and for that matter, uh -oh. even Eurasian brown bears. To be fair, neither of them have to deal with a certain big cat. Like most bears, they're most dangerous when people run into them and the bear feels cornered, and for that reason, attacks are on the rise. From yeah. April 2023 to just November, Whoa. Whoa. 212 people caught the wrong end of Asiatic aggression from a black bear. Six died, and food scarcity means those numbers are probably going up. In fact, that's why they're whacking the hell out of that bear. You see, <laughs> in Japan, you? Yeah. Shit. That <laughs> nigga's scared. I'm not gonna lie. I'm <laughs> chopping wood. <laughs> <laughs> and I ain't gonna lie. I'm going stupid. Well, I'm going, I ain't gonna lie. I'm going crazy. I'm not, no. If, the, if it's only me and bear, I gotta do what I gotta do. At one point, I'm telling you, I'm getting that bear on his stomach and I'm stomping that nigga dick out. Like, like old girl was doing the dude in the last oh, video. Boom, boom. <laughs> that, bear, that bear gonna be roaring, bro. Jeez. Right in the big city and food feeding bears moving into the now less crowded human neighborhoods. Now, so it's lazy. never been easier to find problems with an Asian bear. And from 2000 to 2020, 2,357 black bear attacks have been recorded. 42.4% suffered severe injury, 1.2% ended up with permanent disability, and 4.8% lost the ability to exist. They're dead. And over 20% <laughs> of the attacks happened in August, i.e. right around the time they're getting ready to hibernate. There was even okay. a case earlier this year where a man had to negotiate his arm oh with a my. Swiss knife after the Asian variety refused to let him go. Since this is the first bear that is a somewhat regular threat to people. Yeah, I'm never going to Asia in August. The bear was holding on so long and so strong, he had to cut his own arm with off a Swiss, was it a Swiss with knife? a Swiss knife you know to get out. I don't lie. You had to take your pocket knife, y'all, and yeah, uh, get up uh, while he's holding me, on. Me, I'm, hey! <laughs> I'm stabbing the shit out of that bear. Where you at? at? Y'all appreciate the sub. Bro, Jeez. I'm gonna give the Asiatic black bear a seven. He fighting tigers. Although with the yep. whole bear bile farming thing, ah, we probably had it coming. And now we yeah. get to my honest inspiration uh -oh. for this video. Oh, oh my the god. Brown bear. Oh my but god. Honestly, first, I'm gonna clear something up. The grizzly bear is a subspecies of the brown bear, kind of like how the Arctic wolf is an offshoot of the gray guy. The grizzly is basically a landlocked brown bear. They're further inland, right? their grocery list is a lot shorter, which is why, even though they're the most oh famous, grizzlies aren't even the biggest Terrifying. bears brown and around. They're huh. smaller than the Kamch What? The Kamchatka bear dwarfs grizzlies, mostly because of the fresh supply of salmon they get from shacking up on the Chumkatska Peninsula, which actually has the highest density of brown bears on the planet. There's like 20,000 of them. Not going there. And of course, Not. what y'all know about the Kodiak bear? Named after Kodiak. the Kodiak Islands, nature was. Di that gets so big. And it's always one that got like a legend behind him and be marking shit. Ooh. Forced to vault it on. They can outweigh probably... a grizzly by almost 500 pounds. And that's purely God. off the pescatarian. That is a whole mountain of a bear. Grizzly bears are smaller, but the higher competition and being gate kept from coastal calories makes them that much more aggressive. Which makes them, yeah, I, and I don't like to curse that much, my mom watches me, but that is a fing problem. They're like a predatory Thanos. Your demise is inevitable if they green light it. They have jaws that can crush a bowling ball. Pause that mean. You're a high five oh away from my like a God. I've seen them punk entire wolf packs out of food, and they might be the only thing alive that can choke slam a moose. There's only one only. video that truly encapsulates how fornicated you are if a grizzly chases you. Look at him! Well, other than this, here you have a grizzly running, and way, 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 wow, we st we're still going. Way, way, oh, right there. There, that's the caribou he's after. 
Keep in mind, this is the third second mark of the video. About four minutes was all it took for the seed of Santa to get packed up like a Christmas present and turn to the past. kept going. But how dangerous are brown bears kept actually? kept going. Since 1784, there have been only 82 fatal brown bear conflicts in North America. Yellowstone surprisingly only has eight. Oh, From 2000 to 2015, there were a recorded 664 brown bear attacks around the world, with 99 flatlines. Of these attacks, 17% involved someone with a dog, 10% were after a bear got shot or trapped, aka the okay. person had it coming, 20 percent were sudden encounters and an overwhelming 47 percent involved a female with a cub proving that the only thing more dangerous yeah. than a bear yeah yeah boom yeah. A child. No. Really, <laughs> brown bear attacks in North America a year. 40 if we're talking worldwide. In fact, the chances of getting murked by a brown bear in Yellowstone are 1 in 2.1 million. I do think bears suffer a lot. Still not sticking around. The attacks might not happen often, but when they do, they're usually graphic enough to go international. At the same time, the worst case scenario scares me more than death itself. So brown bears, specifically grizzly okay. bears, get a merc rating of 8. Make that oh, a 5. If you know, you know. Now the soft bears are great example of something Whoa. I always say. You have to convince a predator you're worth the effort, where know, prey will off you before you get the chance. Most mm. bears see humans as a fellow predator. The problem is here you got one that spends most of its life as prey. Sloth bears got tiger trauma in their bloodline. They also get plenty of smoke from leopards, problems from dole packs, and some of the same elephants and rhinos that are they're more aggressive because they always get hunted always on. Always get beat up, bro. Yeah, it's like I'm not letting you get the chance. Are chill-ish around tigers have zero tolerance for the baloos of the world. Add it all up, you get a floppy faced termite eater that's also one of the most violently aggressive animals on the planet. You okay. basically have a giant honey badger with attitude and all the tools to follow through. It's prey trauma with predatory hardware. They don't really know how to kill, they just inflict as much pain as physically They just possible. do what they that's do. That's why many sloth bear victims end up with their faces torn off since mm -hmm. that's their go-to okay. move against tigers. A trauma bear with chimpanzee tendencies means they get a merc rating of 9. There's no good Jeez. word for sloth bear attacks on people, but Jeez. it's the fact that they live on top of and kill more people than other bears that outnumber them. This is technically the most dangerous bear per capita. Uh, it's the one named after a sloth. In fact, one sloth bear was called the man eater of Mysore after he killed 12 people and severely mauled another two dozen. It is something like that's pretty rare, and it's believed the bear was injured by people first and then went on a rampage. Oh, like the last he got his get back for it. To see <laughs> it's getting back. Hey, blood, yeah, remember, bro, yeah. it's getting it back. As prey. I'm gonna kill the suspense right now. The polar bear is a 10 from 1870. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Yeah. The motherfucking monster. Hey, yeah. hey, I like it. The polar bears are 14. Ten. Only 20 people have been killed by polar bears out of 73 attacks, but it's the frequency that's scary. What do I mean? Well, over 60% of attacks happened between 1960 and 2009. 20% happened from 2010 to 2014. That means oh. in this study, 20% oh. of all polar bear attacks happened at less than 3% of the time, and that less than 3% was in the last four years. The polar bear is the only bear that classifies as a hyper carnivore, and they'll try anything from walruses oh my God. to reindeer, oh my and they'll God. even body a beluga whale. As oh you know, God. polar bears are one of the rare animals oh, that I actively see. hurt oh people. God. It's true what they say. If you see a polar bear in the wild, your expiration date's already yeah. stamped. Get they can smell a seal from almost 20 miles away. So you Damn. know when an ice bear pulls up, it's no mistake. The Arctic op is such a threat in Churchill, Manitoba, it's common courtesy to leave car doors unlocked in case someone needs a four-wheeled panic room from a polar bear. The same place, by the mm. way, that has the Churchill Polar Bear Detention Center. And it's exactly what it sounds like. It's an air-conditioned temporary holding cell for polar bears that get way too comfortable around people. No other bear is more of a certified homicide once you make eye wow. contact. But they wouldn't be so bad if it wasn't for receding sea ice basically stranding a marine mammal on land. And like with black bears, it's a starving, desperate rogue males that are most likely to turn a human into a hashtag. Yeah, and that's they just the don't thing. care. Every bear on this list would they easily put humans at a 10. Like I said, Asiatic black bears are the most common victims of bear bile farms. Sloth bears are often kept as dancing tourist traps, which involves brutal maimings and shoving a rope through their nose. Why are they Little doing that? Oh! And despite the memes. Ah! Ah! Humanity has done more to pandas than for them. Also, there's the fact that most True. bears want nothing to do with you. Literally, one of the best ways to avoid a bear is to actually make noise to give the bear a chance to avoid you. Uh, most bear brutalities mm. come from a bear getting jump scared and making a decision. Also, there's bear spray, but bear spray is a lot like a seatbelt. You don't get into a car expecting to do a barrel roll down I-80, but the same yeah. way the seatbelt makes the yeah. worst case better, so does bear spray. In fact, uh, you'll probably never use it. Moral of the story? That's yeah, scary. Honestly, the bear wouldn't even choose us. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this you video. You know the scary part about that? That's bear scary. Uh, a girl. You what? don't have to cut this out of the video. A girl had beef. 
Oh, I know what you're going to say. Bear yeah, Mace did. Yeah, yeah. And it At the gas station? And it yeah. wasn't. The thing about Bear Mace, it's foam, bro. Yeah. So, yeah. that girl. <laughs> <laughs> Turned into a bear. <laughs> Boy. <sighs> Boy. I actually have an entire book on the concept. A hundred animals that can you you can read the title. And again, each animal has a rating based on my so personal wrote a books. And Shout out my dog. My hey, the book will be fifty two percent off on Amazon. If you're interested, okay. the link will be in the description. But other than that, drink water, cherish your parents. Remember, yep. if it's white like a beluga, it's the last time we'll talk to you. And I'll oh. see y'all. Oh. <laughs> wow.